Good afternoon Jackson family. I've just had a shower. It's really sunny and hot today and I'm going to give you the tour. Okay, so as you can see, here is the bed. Um, that's where I sit and do my computing when there is two bars of signal there. Sometimes there's two bars of signal here and very occasionally there's two bars of signal there. So those are my internet spots around the room. A uh, lovely big wide window and map of Skyrim, very important item of equipment there, the fan, can't miss that. Uh, let's go through here, this is the lovely ensuite, as you can see, I have a shower, hooray! It's actually a really big shower cubicle as well, um, and toiletries, hello, a mirror, another really big lovely window, it's not always open like that, it's just air rate because, as I said, I've just had a shower and it's really hot. Um, and then, oh look, there's a New Zealand calendar up there, the big tree, they do that here. Um, and, oh, and a hobbit calendar over here. This is where Bilbo sits with his book. Oh, come on, focus. Never mind. Um, and some bits and bobs there. And there's where the other Bilbo is. This is my wardrobe. Oh, I'll show you on the outside first. So here is some lovely stuff that the young people have done for me and all the lovely cards that people gave me before I left. That's a postcard from Hobbiton and some lovely, lovely stuff. And then inside here, clothes, shoe hangy thing, drawers, shoes and a bag in there. Oh, it's too dark, you can't see. Huh. Big cardigan, won't be needing that. Or oh, that suitcase for a while. Um, and then I have some more drawers and things down here. It's where I keep some stuff, like my camera and the leads and everything. And this is my lovely art drawer. Ooh, art stuff. And then that bottom drawer is just stuff. And a huge big mirror, which is really cool. Um, so, yeah, let's go to the garden. Okay, so the garden is just outside of my door. Open up this door into the garage. Oh, it's windy. A bit drafty there. Big wood pile that is probably home to Shelob and all her children. Past the cars and, sorry guys, mind your eyes. Oh, it's really hot today. Okay, so this is the house and you can see a lovely garden just there and then there's those two windows there. That's the big kind of living room kitchen. For this side of it. It's a nice buddy. Uh, that's um, some gardens and the school field. So there's a school around the other side as well. And this is the church car park and the church is just there. And there's us. So we live next door to the church. Not the one I work for though. Um, that's the cathedral which is further into town. Um, see, you can see the mountain, it's lovely, it's out today, it's been hidden behind the clouds for most of the mornings, but I guess, as you can tell, there's not really any clouds around. I'm going to get off of this tarmac, because I'm not wearing anything on my feet, and it's hot. Yeah, going to go a bit faster. Ow. Okay, so I went inside to put some flip-flop jandals on because my feet were burning. And look what I found outside our door! Dun, 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 dun. Okay, on with the tour. Um, sorry for the brightness of the transition there. So this is part of the compound, I guess is what you would call it. Um, the view over some lovely fields. Let's go show you the fields. There are some sheep down there. Oh, trip. I can walk in flip-flops. Um, that's the school. You can see how lovely and bumpy the land is. It's really like that all over the place around here. Uh, it's very cool. And then we have 
in that garden and that leafy tree you can see there is the avocado tree that's in the shade of the avocado tree. That's the avocado tree and there are birdies in the garden. Oh, you can't see the birdies. Oh, and now it's telling me the battery is low. Uh, so yes, oh, and there are kids playing in the park. So I have a little parking thing attached to the school. This is the school field that we saw from the other way. And then that is the back of the house. So uh, that was the very brief tour of where I'll be staying for my first year here in New Zealand. I uh, hope you liked it. It's a very peaceful place to live. I enjoy being here so far and I think that's it for today. So I will see you soon on the interwebs. Take care folks!